Does it look familiar? It's a little early. It's a couple hours till high tide. I haven't seen any fish yet. I've seen a couple people walk by. Might record a proper intro later. We'll see. But right now, let's let's get fishing. Starting out with our twitching jig. It's actually one of the first ones I tied. It's got the bright yellow chartreuse head with rabbit zonker tail. Some flash. So let's see if we can't find something. And I remember this hill because it tried to kill me. It's gotten more slippery, it looks like. Okay. We're safe. I made it. Alrighty. First cast. Here, fishy fishy. Right in, the, uh, right in that good slot. Here, I'm super excited. I want to catch some more fish. Oh, that's a snag. Darn it. What is up guys, Zach here on another salmon adventure. I found myself at my most productive spot that I have found this year. So we're back again, hopefully we can pull some fish out. I'm using twitching jigs and drifting eggs. Stick with me guys, this should be a fun day. And let's pull in some fish. Let's get in the chest cam and get fishing because I think I just saw salmon swim right up, right in front of me. Yep, all right, let's do this. Damn adventure getting up and down the bank. All right, let's try to drift some eggs through here. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Figured it would be a slow morning with the tide not coming until later. So, debating whether to just wait here and fish this one hole for, until the tide comes in, like last time. If we do some exploring and try some other holes. I think my best chance might be this, this area. I did so well last time, I feel like if the tide comes in and pulls a bunch of fish in, I should do good this time. If you want. What's up, Jordan? How's it going? Good. You want the rod too? Yeah, you guys have any luck? Getting some chum. Got a couple of chromers and it's been nice. Yeah. yeah. How about you? Not yet. No. Nope. Uh, like an hour ago. I haven't seen anything happening though, so. We got one right around the corner, but that was like the only coho we've gotten since we started. Caught like seven chum. Yeah. Buddy, well, good to meet you. Yeah, it was good to meet you too. Good luck. Yeah, yeah. watch out for that branch. Yeah, I'll probably snag it again, but. <laughs> you know it well because you were right on the very tip of it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Damn it. That much more you. <laughs> All right, you guys have a good one. Well, that was fun seeing Jordan. Shout out to Jordan with the uh, addicted crew. It's always nice seeing. You know, someone who knows what they're doing on the same river. So at least I kind of know what I'm doing. It's validation. So yeah, there's two two potential problems. If I stay here and the fish don't ever come up with the tide, then I miss out. Or if I move and try to find the fish, they could come up with the tide and wherever I go might not be that good. I'm thinking I kind of just want to stay. It just feels like a low, you know, pretty chill day. Let me just chill here, wait for the tide to come up. It's up a couple inches now. I'm thinking the fish might start, might start filtering in. So we got a couple hours left, making my way to one spot. We're chasing them upriver. 
I haven't been skunked for salmon in a couple trips, which is rare for me. So this would be like a return to the norm. Abby? Good, how are you? Let's you get by. Been a good day. Oh, hell yeah, nice. Definitely been a good day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice job. Yeah. Have a good one, guys. It feels like everyone can catch a fish but me. <sighs> That's what it's feeling like. You guys mind if I fish right here? Or? Cool. I'm going to strategically get some of my eggs. This will be the first time I've actually fished with mine, not the store bought ones. They look way better. No luck. Just on to the next spot. <sighs> Dang it. There's my last handmade one. Oh. oh yeah, fish on! Oh, he popped off! He's a little guy. He's a little chum. It's the most action I've got all day. Crap. Yes, what is it? What is it? Oh, it's a silver, it's a silver. I think it's a silver. Come here, buddy. Yes, it is, it is. It's a Koho. Oh my god, not skunked. Come here, buddy. Yes, I can't believe this. I can't believe it, I'm so stoked. Oh, perfect. Oh my god, oh my god. Nope, he's not done yet, he's not done yet. Come here. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh man, that is a beauty. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> <laughs> not skunked. Literally, I'm texting Jess. I was like, I gotta go soon. This is the last spot. I'm at the last spot. I haven't caught a single fish. Holy cow, that might be the biggest one I've caught this year. It only took me like six or eight hours. Let's go. Let's go. Oh gosh, look at that fish. Yes. Yes. Whew. Oh yeah, look at that. That was a, that was a <laughs> that was a lot of work for that one fish. I was here quite a few hours. I'm feeling pretty good about that now. Let's go. Okay, let's get another one. On the red and black. It's that nightmare color, man. I love it. I will say, coho don't really have the same fight as chum. Like they really don't. They have some fight for sure, but not. Like chum can just they can beat you up. I can pull another one out, like, holy crap, that would just be like the ultimate reversal. <laughs> so let's fish for about 10 more minutes, and then we'll head out. 10 more minutes, a fish, or my lure breaks. Well, that's a silver. Oh, maybe not. I don't know how it is. What the f 
fuck? What the f They caught a chum, cut its tail to see if it had good meat, and then just gutted it. And probably bagged the eggs and carried on their merry day. For those of you watching, that's super and illegal. And they probably got two coho on top of it. Huge douche move. Like, that's really, that's honestly makes me angry. If you guys are fishermen, right? Like, you're watching this and you want to go fishing, read the regs. Don't do anything illegal. Don't do anything unsustainable. Play by the rules. Care for your fishery. Care for your rivers. Like, that's the opposite of caring for the, the salmon run. Alrighty, guys. Let's call it. We, we outie. Real grind of a day turned into awesome. It, like, literally the last 20, 30 minutes of the day turned out to be great. And that's fishing. Sometimes it is just seven and a half hours of nothing and then that one cast makes it all worth it. Signing off for today. I, I just wanted to do a quick outro. That was a, that was a real a grind of a day, but we did end up at the very last spot. We did end up with this beautiful fish. It's like nine pounds or so. Beautiful hen, I believe. So that should be full of eggs. Gorgeous, bright hen. I'm super excited. That was an amazing end of the day. I was bas I was literally like, well, I guess I got zero for today. I accident. I think I accidentally hooked one chum, and then that is the only action I've gotten all day. Anyway, I gotta pack up. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna cure some eggs. I'm gonna fillet some fish. Thanks for watching. As always, subscribe if you haven't yet. Comment below what you think. You know, do you like these salmon videos? Uh, I certainly am having a blast this salmon season. Best salmon season I've ever had. And it's awesome. So comment below what you think. You know, like this video. Like it for that fish. Oh, that fish is beautiful. I really appreciate you guys coming and watching my videos. So thank you guys. Until next time, I will, uh, I'll keep fishing and you keep fishing.